Hello everyone, Plant Assassin here. Today I want to talk to you about blanket flowers. You see here we had one that a local bee was just getting the pollen off of. Now blanket flowers are part of the sunflower family and they are very drought tolerant and they attract a lot of pollinators. Uh, these particular plants I have back here are uh, growing in an area of the yard where I don't tend a lot. It's kind of in a difficult area to uh, to mow so we ended up just planting some some wildflowers back here. Now this particular one is a hybrid of uh, two different species and uh, blanket flowers are in the sunflower family and they are native to North and South America. This is what happens when they start to go to seed. And then here's one here that... And over here we have a nice so there are several species of moths that are uh, very beautiful to look at they are orange and red and look a lot like the blanket flowers but they are um, some of the natural pollinators at night and also the uh, caterpillars use this species for a host to grow on. And then down here we have a one that's getting ready to flower. So if you're looking for a uh, <coughs> flower that is very drought tolerant and is attractive to look at and blooms for a long time you might want to check out blanket flowers so they're also native so they already have a symbiotic relationship to our local uh, bees and butterflies and moths so if you like this video please like and subscribe